I'm Mara, and I'm here to help you navigate the waters of online dating. It's a match. I'm going to give you some tips on writing your perfect bio for your online dating profile. You want to make a great first impression when introducing yourself. Things to include in your bio. Your hobbies. Rock climbing. Scuba diving. Fly fishing. Watching me sleep is not a hobby. If you're not native to the city, maybe include where you grew up or where you're from. Include major aspects of your life. If you have children, a wife, you're writing from prison, if you have six months to live, because I'm looking for a commitment. Don't mention any past relationship baggage or emo shit. We don't want your sob stories. For a lot of girls, height is a deal breaker. So if you're under six foot, you don't have to volunteer that information. There's no need to mention your political or religious beliefs unless it's an absolute deal breaker for you. Like if you're Amish, you can, well, if you're Amish, you wouldn't be on Tinder. If you're looking for a casual hookup, mention that. It's gonna weed out those looking for something more long-term. And there are sites specifically designed for your particular orientation, like Christian Mingle or FarmersOnly.com. And JDate, that's Jewish. Some sites let you choose a specific username. Try to go for something fun, like your hobby plus your name, Surfer Sam or Golfing Greg. Try to steer away from things like Black Anaconda 69. Never use the number 69 anywhere. Don't include your penis size, however impressive or depressive it may be. And last but not least, please spell check. You don't want any mistakes in your bio, even if you think you're the goodest writer around. So setting up good profile pictures and a great bio will help you get that ever elusive first match. Tune in next time when I guide you through more topics of online dating. Here are some examples of what not to do in your profile picture. Don't post a picture of you in your luxury car, especially if it isn't your luxury car.